Hello everyone. Here's something uh, truly unique and one of a kind that I've decided to do. Uh, I'm following this gentleman on Instagram where he does similar models, but only uh, in 143rd scale. So I had a 118th scale and decided to try something of my own uh, to duplicate it because I think they're super cool what it does. This is the uh, BMW X5 um, 4x4 safari uh, uh i guess a buggy whatever you want to call it off-road buggy uh with tons of detail as you can see it's uh muddied out and rusted uh, looks like it's been around the world several times i've installed the big wheels on it the car does roll uh, installed some radio antennas and cb antennas on the back uh some accessories on the roof strapped down to the roof spare tire ladders uh uh boxes uh, uh and other uh what is this cloth just like uh, spare parts for the car it makes it uh, as realistic as possible i've also installed the custom push bar on the front with spotlights i mean uh, not spotlights but uh, fog lights uh fog lights on the roof i've installed uh a guard bar on the back holding the two gas tanks uh, as you can see like I said it's overall looks like it's been around the world several times this is uh, muddied out these uh, things are I called I think they're called brush guards I actually do have them on my Jeep as well they keep uh, branches from hitting you and damaging your windshield uh, I strapped it down to the hood so they're functional the engine bay opens the hood opens as you can see the engine's also been muddied out when you close it these things keep from branches from hitting your windshield i'm not really sure what they call it, brush guards or something um very cool the bottom has been muddied out as well it's truly unique one of a kind that you will not see anywhere um if you're a bmw fan and you want to add something unique to your collection then this is it it does come with its box I haven't figured out it will if it will fit or fit or not because it's uh, quite a bit higher than the, the stock model. So worst case scenario, I will take the wheels off, and all you have to do is just uh, put them back in place and just push them in place. Because like I say, I'm not sure about the height if it'll fit in the box or not. If it does fit in the box, then the wheels will come just the way it is. If not, then I'll I'll put them aside. So all you have to do is really easy, just put them inside these tubes right here. Just push them in and you're good to go. Um, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to ask. Again, uh, features op also opening front doors. The interior is muddy and dirty. Nice little safari Jeep. Um, please ask uh, any question you might have and uh, thanks for watching.